Today I have a super cool, super amazing listening and speaking practice for you. Now every time I do a lesson, I'm just gonna do that. So today I have a really great lesson because I think it's a very, very useful activity because it will get you listening and speaking, which is so important. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to give you a couple stories and you have to listen for the details. So this is how it's gonna work. I'm going to read the story to you twice and then in order to help you remember the story, I'm going to give you some clues. As you follow the clues, you can remember the story and I will ask you to pause Pause the video, say the story using the clues, and then to make this even more fun and a little bit more embarrassing for Wes, we're going to bring him over here and he is going to do this exercise with you. So this is kind of a memory, listening, uh, detail exercise, but it's also a speaking exercise because you'll have to speak. It's gonna be fun. So Wes is here. <laughs> I am here to do this activity with you. We brought him so that it's funny. It's funnier. <laughs> <laughs> I'm test my listening skills. Yeah, I mean, it's just funnier than just uh, doing it by ourselves, right? So um, he's going to do this exercise with you. He's going to listen to the story. I have it right here on my phone. I'll read the story to, to, to Wes and to you guys. And then um, I will ask you to pause the video and then to try to say the story as you see the clues and then unpause it to hear Wes. <laughs> to see how much I remember. So here's the first story. The Eiffel Tower is a famous landmark in Paris. It was built between 1887 and 1889 for the World Fair. The tower is 324 meters tall and it is made of iron. When the tower was built, it was only meant to be kept for 20 years. People didn't like the Eiffel Tower because they thought it was an ugly structure polluting the scenery of the Paris sky. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of numbers in there. I know. Okay. All right. I know. One more time. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So this is, it's also a bit of history. So, <laughs> okay, I'll say it one more time if you, if you can't remember it. Okay. The Eiffel Tower is a famous landmark in Paris. It was built between 1887 and 1889 for the World Fair. The tower is 324 meters tall and it is made of iron. When the tower was built, it was only meant to be kept for 20 years. People didn't like the Eiffel Tower because they thought it was an ugly structure polluting the scenery of the Paris sky. Okay. I don't think that was too bad. All right, we'll no, see. No, the next one's pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I hope you were able to get all those numbers down uh, because now it's time to retell the story that I just said. So please pause the video right now and use the clues that you see on the screen to retell the story. Try to remember as many details as you can. Okay, so I hope you guys got most of that. Yeah? <laughs> I know the years were a little bit tricky. Now let's see how Wes did. All right. Wait. Okay, so I'm showing him the clues. <laughs> I want to see them before I forget. Yeah. Okay, so um, so I'm showing him the clues right now. If you want, I can read it to you one more time. No, 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 it's fine. Okay. If I screw up, I screw up. Okay. Um, okay, so the, the Eiffel Tower was built in Paris, uh, France. It was built from 19, no, not 19, 1887 to 1889 for the World's Fair, which is what they were hosting. The, it is 324 meters tall and it's made of iron. And originally it was only supposed to be there for 20 years because the people thought it was really ugly and ruined the skyline, but then they decided to keep it, and, and now it's a very uh, famous landmark in Paris. Is that right? Is that good? Everything? It's true, but you added some stuff that wasn't in the story. <laughs> I added some. Why not? I, yeah, ad-lib. Give a little more information. What, what did I add? 
well you added the the last part that now it's like an important line. it's true <laughs> but <laughs> but it wasn't in the story okay nice also, excellent it's the world fair world fair the worlds it belongs to all of us no. the world's fair the world fair the world's fair the world fair Wor world's fair world fair <laughs> <laughs> oh no it's fine okay wait i don't want to look at these other clues Whoops. okay so i hope you guys got that um it I think I think what could have been tricky were the years because there are a lot of numbers. But I hope you got it. Was it really well? So <laughs> rocked it. So are you guys ready for the second story? Are you ready? I think so. Yeah. This, this is the this is the weird one. Yeah, a little bit. All right. So this one's a little strange, but go with it. Okay. Snow. <laughs> Sorry. Snow. It's about snow. It's about okay. snow. All right. I okay. got that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Snow is a form of ice. Snow forms when water in the atmosphere becomes frozen. Snow comes in all different shapes and sizes. Snow melts and becomes liquid water above zero degrees Celsius. Snow is used for winter sport activities like skiing or sledding. People also commonly build things out of snow for fun, like a snowman. Snow can also be dangerous as it can lower visibility and can make driving very difficult. To prevent accidents in snowy conditions, sand or salt may be added to the road to help tires grip the road. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Okay. I have another It's just a little long. To... It's very logical. So, I mean, I, yeah. I'm just trying to remember the, the different details. Okay. So, are you going to read it again? Okay. So, one more time. Snow is a form of ice. Snow forms when water in the atmosphere becomes frozen. Snow comes in all different shapes and sizes. Snow melts and becomes liquid water above zero degrees Celsius. Snow is used for winter sport activities like skiing or sledding. People also commonly build things out of snow for fun, like a snowman. Snow can also be dangerous, as it can lower visibility and can make driving very difficult. To prevent accidents in snowy conditions, sand or salt may be added to the road to help tire, tires grip the road. Okay. Okay. So now it's time for you to pause the video and use the clues on the screen to help you remember the story. Now, this one's a little bit more difficult, so don't feel bad if you couldn't remember all the details. I hope you guys got most of that right, or all of it. Uh, if you did, great job. Now, let's see how Wes does. All right, let's see. Uh... <laughs> snow. <laughs> this is the first thing. What is snow? Um, oh, gosh, I feel like I forgot now. All of a sudden, I see the clues, and now it's all... Oh, no. Okay, so um, snow is um, frozen water. It forms by. <laughs> wait, I, I kind of forgot the beginning. Wait, wait. So s snow is just uh, no. It's like frozen ice, and <laughs> frozen ice. Snow is frozen. All right, it's frozen water. Okay, it forms uh, high up in the sky where it's cold and the water, the, uh, it comes in all shapes and sizes and it becomes, uh, it becomes, snow becomes water when the temperature goes above zero degrees Celsius. There are many different winter sports that involve snow like skiing and sledding. It's also, there's fun stuff that we can do with the snow and build things like a snowman. Um, you could also build igloos and castles. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to add that to it. Uh, it can, snow can be very dangerous when driving because it, it lessens our visibility um, or lowers our visibility when driving. And in order to prevent accidents when there's snowy conditions out there, you could use like salt or sand to put on the roads um, to help the, the tires grip the road a little better. So. 
And snow How is that? the best. Snow. Snow is snow. wonderful. Yeah. I, I think I really botched that beginning. But <laughs> the beginning was a little iffy. You forgot about the atmosphere. Oh, yeah, yeah, You're yeah. You're like yeah, high yeah. up in the air. Yeah. I hope you did a better job than I did. Please let us know if you participated in the lesson. And if you did, write the word speaking in the comments so I know that you were speaking. If you enjoy this activity, hit that like button, show us some love and keep practicing, keep speaking, keep listening and your skills will improve greatly. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Let us know if you did better than Wes. <laughs> no, I, no. I'm very curious. <laughs> to rub it in. Stupid snow. <laughs>